What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another highlight video. This is part of the throwback series. Had a great run in a 109 bounty and uh, yeah, nothing fancy here. Just tournament poker. Hope you guys enjoy this tournament and I will see you in the next video. On the other table, the short stack gets it an ace queen against queens and ace queen wins, which now makes me the short stack in the field and I'm all in kings. We know how this goes. Chat, we know how this goes. Kings on the bubble. We know how this goes. Hopefully well. Nice. 27 bigs. Okay, we'll take that. I mean, the 109, we're going to we're gonna try to win this thing. Uh, we could definitely have a profitable day if we do. Yeah, the big stack's being on the button in the small blind. Probably a position I got to be tighter in here with the ace 8. Easy positions to get played back at. Ace jack, ace king. All right, we're done. The bubble's done. You're in the money, not bad. All right, so bounties, we have just one for 25. I mean, cash is worth 110. And let's see what we can do past that. Fold the king deuce. So we have an all in on the other table. Just an open shove. The short stacks are over here. We get a call from the 20 big blind stack. Eights, ace king, and ace seven. Okay, we need, s yeah, okay. Okay, I don't think anybody busted here. Oh, the boat. Never mind, I'm dumb. All right, final table time in the 109. Not bad. Going in with 20 big blinds. All right, so first thing to see, short stack of the big blind. I'm sure I'm not the only one that notices. Just gonna stay out of the way. Stay out the way. <laughs> How bad is your hand? Oh, it folds. It's bad enough to fold. Okay, I'm gonna go for a min raise. <clears throat> I think min raise is the play. All right, poker gym. Come on, bro. That was the time for you. All right, I'm gonna raise call. Jack says three. Please hold. That's a good start. Very good. Very, very, very good. Very strong hold there. I mean, this is definitely the kind of final table scenario where like you want to try to double up at this stage and get the big stack and play for these bounties. It's definitely that kind of that kind of field. All right, finally get some fireworks here. We have a shove and a shove. Mega mind all in. Big blind wants a piece of that bounty. Nine ten ace jack ace jack. I approve. Look at the look at the size of the ladder. It's basically nothing. Get the play for this bounty. Try to chip up. However, it's not going to pay off for poker gym this time. It's always important to look at the structure of these 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 tournaments because final table doesn't mean final table, right? Like, gotta look at the payouts. Look at your opponents. There's a lot to take into account. That's a spot where it makes a ton of sense for Poker Gym to try to hunt some dollars and triple up. That's about perfect. We go heads up, dominating. That's pretty much the best it gets. After picking up a 5x situation, that's just... Alright, I'm in. I'm in for a raise. Jack-10 suited. Nice flop, Jack-9-3. See that? We do have raise shove here. Again, a lot of fold equity on this regen when it's for so many big blinds. Do get a call from King Queen. A7 goes for the regen. It's quite loose. It's going to hold though. Wow. Quite a loose regen. I don't know if that was just like F it, I'm going with an ace, or if it was like calculated based on how much it, they've been raising recently. Big blind not letting me get away with anything there. I don't know what to do on the button here. Like I'm thinking I probably want to have like some shoves here in the PKO with this stacks, these two stacks. Cause like small blind when I just go for an open raise, like they get to just shove on me over and over and over again. Ooh, kings and ace queen, big pot, big pot, one million in the middle. Nobody else, nobody even has close. Ace queen spikes the turn for the ladder for the elimination. Deadly, nice. Call out of the small blind. Ace king, five board. See a lead. Okay, I'm gonna call fold. 
I mean, they can have... I mean, they probably do have tall pair, but they can also have ace of diamonds, which just has me dead. Like, ace of diamonds here has me dead. They have to be pot potting it with 10 nine of diamonds, eight nine of diamonds after calling against 20 big blind open. I don't think it's an automatic... I uh, don't think it's an automatic send it there with the queen jack of diamonds. Pretty crazy that the small blind calls and I end up in an ugly spot with, with a flush draw there, but that's how it works. Kings and ace queen, we're gonna need a nine. Found a nine. Let's go! Nice, man. Damn, out of all the spots, I was not ready for that one to come through for us. Okay. We're back in the ball game. Pretty sick. Let's go. Guys, we need this we need this win to have a winning day. That was big. That was really big. Wow. Alright, we have shove, shove, shove. King Queen eights and eights nine. King Queen is struggling. Eights is not. Okay, we're down to five. Ratlip up to 820k. Alright, so we have one clear short stack, three tied in the mid, and one clear big stack. It's a classic dynamic. Um, here, okay, we're covered. I'm gonna go for the limp jam here. If they shovel fold. Alright, limp jam activated. I've activated my trap card, but it's not really a trap, but it kind of is, but kind of not. Taking it down, 600k. That's a nice little uh, transfer of of stacks there. Now we cover. King, king, five remain. So sick. Jack, eight, deuce, see bet. Also have some big bets here. We go for a check raise. Jack deuce, eight deuce. God, they don't have much here, I don't think. I'm trying to think. Ooh, we don't have any big blinds. All right, I'm gonna go for the peel. Ace turn, they could have ace jack. Could have ace jack. I don't think really any other ace is a very frequent check raise at all. I think every, every other ace would just be a weird, weird check raise. They check it to me, I'm gonna go for a small bet. I don't know like what to do on the flop. It's kind of interesting. Like part of me wants to put in like a click back three bet. Part of me wants to go for the slow play. Part of me wants to go for the fast play because I can just I can get it in against the jack, like an ace jack, king jack, queen jack, or something, and just gain the chip lead, gain the big chip lead, or or pick up what's already in there. I kind of chose the slow play and like try to really find the full double up there, since I I just feel like they don't have a ton of value bets on that board. They're just gonna have air like a bunch. So that's what I went for. This is gonna be a shove here. Any ace. Any ace, but not all aces. It's gonna be a shove with the queen jack suited. It's a, it, I don't think it's a hand we wanna raise call off. So we're gonna go for the shove instead. It's definitely a profitable shove. Snap call by the small blind. It's a flip, it's a big one. Starts well. And it rivers well. Nice. Let's go. Flipping well. We sucked out with the nines. This one I wouldn't hate to raise fold against this stack and then raise call here. I think I'll still go for a shove though. Don't really mind if they call. I mean, I want that $200 bounty. Definitely. Maybe do like the raise more though because we can raise call small. I, th I feel like I do like the raise with that hand. I, I wish I could go back. I wish I could go back. Just because we get to play against the big blind with hands that we dominate, right? Like, maybe they call off king jack and queen jack suited. But, like, we get to play against all the hands that defend for the big blind. And, again, we can raise call the small blind. So, it would suck if the big blind shoved. But, they'll probably mainly defend and fold, right? So, I think, yeah. I think if I could go back, I would probably raise the king queen. They raise, I'm going to shove. They seem hesitant in the first place. We do okay against the calling range here. I think it's going to be like ace king, ace queen, and like pairs. We do fine against all that. Fold out queen 10, king 10, king queen. I think they would fold ace 10, ace jack in the ICM dynamic, but I'm not sure. They might call those hands. But yeah, I think. Oh, he's going to call. Wow. Oh. Okay, you got me. <laughs> you did get me. I'll give you that. King jack, I'm going to shove. 
Snap called here, 215 bounty. Again, we don't really mind going for this. We, we want to play for the bounties in the small field, if it's this one at least. Maybe not Lexington's. Like, this one doesn't really matter, but this one's pretty good. <laughs> Ratlip scared me. He scared me with the, the good luck. I'm pretty sure we want them to fold, but I don't know. I don't know what they're tanking with. Maybe it's a hand that we were dominating. Who knows? All right, no king, no jack. They're back in the game. All right, we see a jam for 18 here. King, queen. I think I get to call king, queen. Like, I feel like they're going to have some hands that I dominate. We're going to flip for the with, against pairs a lot. I don't think they're going to have ace, king, ace, queen. Come on, please. Let's go. We pick up the bounty. Very nice. All right, we're chip leading three-handed. Yeah, so I think, like, he can have those good hands, but, like, ace-five does okay against all those pairs, and uh, I think it's really easy for them to just have a bunch of bluffs, basically. This one's... Oof, I feel like close between a raise and a shove. All right, just gonna open and shove the king five. We're applying the pressure as the chip leader here, three-handed, doing everything I can. I gotta do it quickly before it all comes through the stream, you know? Nine's gonna go for the raise. Call. All right, we're gonna call for the win. We're gonna call for the win. I think we still get the call here. Good luck. Ace, queen, king, jack, keep it low. Oh my God, keep it low for the win. <sighs> keep it low. Oh my, let's go. <laughs> First place in the 109, all the bounties. Hell yeah, $1,629. Wow, that is, I've never finished a, a, a tournament like that. I've always wanted to. That's like a bucket list finish to knock both second and third out at the same time. I don't think I've ever done that before. What a dream. And that does give us a winning session as well. Wow, nice. Let's go, what a finish. All right, see you guys next time. Peace out. Thanks for the stream. Bye-bye.